like. That's right. Well, you would have been able to see, yeah, because they wanted a clear shot. Okay. One of the challenges of a path is we can't all get up. But there is the end of the French line as it loops back and around. And actually, right in here is where um, Amherst built one of his siege batteries. This, this one, there's two. One on what is the, from the outside, it's on the right of the lines. And there's one on the left. But where they came in, in the U, Amherst then adds siege batteries to put his cannon behind him to face the fort. So this is one of them here. So the fort's, the fort's kind of this direction, off in this way. So that's the end of the French lines. We're going to loop all the way around this half of the lines. And you're going to see, we're going to start going downhill. And the lines are always going to be above us. So just to give you a sense, that at least from the sides, from the two flanks of the French line, there's no practical way to attack because it's all uphill. Even though the chutes down here, you could land troops, but it's really tough. The only, the only obvious practical place to attack is in the center, which we'll look at because it's, it's a flat, entry, flat approach to the center.